How are you feeling then? Mad. Seven-year-old Andreas Garcia, his lips quivering as he recounts the story, the day his long locks were chopped without his permission. The incident happening more than a week ago at Dell City Elementary School. The family of the first grader shocked. How do you not notice two kids standing over someone and getting their hair cut? Saying his long hair represented their Kickapoo heritage. Boys have long hair, you know, it's just a traditional way. Just shows who they are. Yeah. And all that. You know, he loves his hair. He took the time to grow it out. The family adding the school did reach out days after it happened, but as far as they're concerned, it was too little and too late. The school did not contact me at all until Saturday morning, and yet they want to investigate it, but not until Monday when school goes back in. Middell Superintendent Rick Cobb releasing a statement Thursday night saying in part, we recognize the significance of hair to our students' identities and do not take this lightly. Any students found to be involved will receive discipline in a manner consistent with steps outlined in our student handbook. Come Monday, the family hopes the district will do the right thing. No kid should have to go through this at all, and I want something done for my son. The school did say their investigation was delayed due to a snow day and spring break, but the family says they're waiting to see what the outcome of that probe will be before they determine their next steps.